And today bring us a quick look at the Alago Aluminum Mouse Pad. So of course, without further ado, let's slice this open, test it out, and give you guys my quick in-depth review. The mouse pad does come in four different colors. This one here is silver, but it's also available in dark gray, rose gold, and gold. So I wanted to spice up my Mac setup a little bit more with a nice Mac matching mouse pad. This aluminum pad here is from a company called Alago, which makes a multitude of Mac matching accessories. And for those of you who picked this up, it comes in your traditional clear plastic packaging here. Pops easily open like so. And the first and only thing that we're introduced with is the mouse pad itself. So as you guys can see here, it's a pretty simple and basic design, which is what I like about this. It's a slim piece of aluminum, or as some people would say, aluminium. And it pretty much features the identical anodized silver matte finish that Apple uses on their MacBooks and iMacs. The aluminum pad does have a bit of heft to it, thanks to its solid design. And I'm really happy the company didn't make this mouse pad too big nor too small. Here's the size of my hand, which I'd say is pretty average. And here's my magic mouse for better reference. This size should suffice for most users out there. The great thing about having a mouse pad that isn't too big and isn't too small is that it doesn't take up a whole lot of desk space. Anyways, not much to really give you guys an overview of. It's basically a slim, solid piece of aluminum with an anodized silver finish. On the underside here, you have the aluminum pad logo, four built-in rubber feet to keep your mouse pad in place, and that is pretty much it. So here is what the mouse pad looks like with my unofficial desk setup here. As you can see, it matches really nicely with my Thunderbolt display, or for those of you with an iMac. And works pretty well with the Alago P2 stand that I have behind it supporting my iPhone and my MacBook stand as well. You can see here the mouse pad doesn't take up a whole lot of space. Right next to my keyboard, it's almost the width of it and still gives you plenty of wrist and palm area to rest. Alago did design the finish on this mouse pad to be smooth for your mouse to slide easily over and thus allowing a nice comfortable use of the mouse pad without that sandpaper-like finish that some other aluminum anodized finishes have. In terms of any cons or things I don't like about this aluminum mouse pad, the only thing I could say is the rubber grips I wish were kind of bigger. As you saw earlier, there's only four tiny rubber feet that holds it in place, and I think a single large pad similar to what they have like on their H stand here would solve that issue in terms of grip. In addition with a large pad, I think that would also reduce that hollow sound when you tap on the mouse pad. In conclusion guys, for those who are looking for an aluminum mouse pad for your desk setup, you definitely can't go wrong with the Alago aluminum pad. Anyways, thanks for watching guys. Hope you all enjoyed the video. And if you have any questions or comments about this mouse pad, let me know in the comment section there down below. Hit that like button as always helps me out and I'll see you all in the next video.